Montgomery Zoo. We're sorry you guys can't be here, but we are here to assure you guys that our elephants are doing fine and dandy while y'all are gone. This is Star. She's our matriarch of the herd. She's 37. And right now she's enjoying an apple. In the back, the closest one is McKenna. She's special to us. She was the first elephant born in the state of Alabama, and she was born right here. And standing behind her is her mother, Tina. Um, part of their daily routine includes we'll bring them inside, give them breakfast, and before we let them out, we'll pick one of them a day. We'll rotate them every day, and they'll get a bath or a short training session before they come back outside. To enjoy their hay that they have out here. Oh, that one's saying. Um, they'll get some treats. And they really, really like their treats. They eat a lot of food every day. Um, and they only digest about 40% of what they eat. Um, so they have a lot of piles out here. And that really helps the environment. Because the seeds from what they eat, as they walk, they're dropping the seeds in little piles of fertilizer. So that helps to replant everything. <laughs> um... If you want to so you can see here that star has her two tusks and they're actually teeth elephant teeth grow from the back to the front so those are just two really long teeth they're their incisors um, if you look in the back you can see Tina has one long and one short but that's because she cracked her tusk on a rock and had to be cut off and she stood there and ate treats while that while it happened it didn't hurt her no sedatives she just stood there. And McKenna has short tusks because that's a genetic thing. Um, her dad had really short tusks as well. <laughs> All right, and um, so if you guys wanna check back in tomorrow, there will be another video featuring another one of our animals. And we really miss you guys. Y'all have a great day.